Hi guys, it's Thomas Moran here and I'm a professional gambler. Today's video is going to be about football accumulators, what they are, how we can place the bets and how we can actually make more money from placing these accumulators. Please guys, if you like these videos, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification so you can see all these videos as soon as they come out. So the definition of an accumulator is where more than one outcome has to happen so say two football teams to win, that is technically an accumulator. It's actually called a double and with three selections, it's called a treble. So I think some people might get confused. They might think an accumulator has to be more than four, four or more, but actually an accumulator is a double as well. So it's when you pick two teams uh, in the football sense, say here we pick Portsmouth uh, against Arsenal, we pick Arsenal to win, and then we pick Nottingham Forest to beat Middlesbrough away from home. And that there is a two team accumulator. So how do we work out the odds of an accumulator? This is something I'm not sure that everyone knows, but it's a very simple formula for any kind of accumulator that you want to place. If it's be the horses, if it's football, boxing, anything, what you need to do is you need to get the decimal odds of whatever odds you're backing. And then you just need to keep multiplying them to the amount of selections. So in this example, if we wanted to work out the double between Portsmouth uh, uh, so Arsenal to beat Portsmouth and then Nottingham Forest to beat Middlesbrough, we can just get our calculator up and then cancel this. And then we can have a look at what the odds are for Arsenal to beat Portsmouth. So the best price for Arsenal to beat Portsmouth is one to two, as it shows here on Odds Checker. And then if we looked at the odds of Nottingham Forest to beat Middlesbrough, the odds are seven to four. So what we'd need to do is we'd need to convert these odds into decimal odds. So the odds of one to two, that's a fractional odd. Um, but off the top of my head, it's a odds of 1.5 in decimals. So we type in 1.5 and all we need to do is times it by Nottingham Forest and fractional odds of seven to four are decimal odds of 2.75. So already our double, which is an accumulator, it will odds of four point, uh, the return from a pound would be four pounds and it would they would round it up to four pounds and 13 pence so you're getting just over three to one on a double which is great you know this is why accumulators are popular and this is why we all like doing them so what's great about accumulators is we can put in so many different variants so we could put in six or seven football teams up to as many as you want and then it just keeps accumulating accumulating and accumulating it's great if you really fancy a lot of teams on one certain day so how do you place an accumulator well it's very simple on if you go into a betting shop you'll have a betting slip you write down your selections Again, we'll use Arsenal. You put Arsenal, you can put the odds down, and then you put in Nottingham Forest, put the odds down, and you can put the, say you want to put a pound on it, you put a pound in the bottom stake, and uh, then they put it through the till. Nowadays, it's a lot easier because you have quick slips, and you can mark each individual. It's so quick. You can mark home draw away on each of the games, so you could very quickly do a 15-match accumulator, and they put it through the till. you find out your returns at the bottom, lovely, all done. But on the internet, you've got many more options. So here, if I wanted to place an accumulator on just the FA Cup um, tomorrow and tonight, I could do Arsenal to beat Portsmouth. I could do a draw with Chelsea and Liverpool. And I could do, say, Sheffield United to win. And then what would happen on the right-hand side here, you've got all three, it would say singles at the top here, but then you could go into multiples and this is where we want to be looking because then you want to find the treble um, situation, yeah, just the treble box. And then it will tell you the odds of 10.41. So I place my, say I wanted to put 50p on, you place 50p and it will tell you that you'll win £5.20. And uh, all you'd need to do is place the bets. I will place this one just for just to show you guys. You never know, might, might make £5.00. And, um, and bet placed. So you've placed an accumulator, really nice and simple. And if you want to place as many as you want, you can play, pick as many selections. You could do the bet in probably 20 seconds, pick all the teams you want to do, do exactly what I just did there, and you're done. 
the real question about football accumulators is how do I get my the best money and value from these accumulators? Because it's all well and good just doing them for a bit of fun. But how can we make some value out of these things? And the best tip for anyone trying to do a football accumulator is to try and find value selections. So say we really liked, um, we really thought Portsmouth might beat Arsenal in the FA Cup tonight. And we thought six to one, that is absolutely massive. I can't believe they're not two to one. They, they, they're they at home. Arsenal lost their last game. We've won four, uh, three of our last four. Surely we're going to put out a strong team and Arsenal aren't. Then we'd think, oh, okay, so we've got six to one here. We could do this. That's when already you've made your hacker already a lot more um, valuable than most people will do because you found a selection and you've realized, okay, already I'm getting six to one on something I think's got a got a decent chance of winning. Then we look down at another game and then we try and find value in that one and we see Middlesbrough on a really bad run and we think, well, Nottingham Forest are right at the near the top of the championship. They may be away from home, but they do need to win this to keep their title race going. Seven to four. I thought that was going to be half those odds. So they, this is already great. What we think we would be getting paid maybe only, I don't know, five to one. We're now getting roughly about three times that, which is fantastic. We're probably getting sort of 18 to one. That's where we can make more money from these accumulators. And if you can find two, three, four of these value picks on, on a, say, a Saturday, then these accumulators that in your head may be only worth 20 to 1, you might be getting 100 to 1 with the bookmakers because you feel they've priced them up wrong. And that's a great start. Secondly, once we've picked all of those teams and we've realized we need what we need to do is we need to get the best price. And this is where this site, Odds Checker, is incredible. I've mentioned it in a couple of videos previously, but it's an odds comparison site where it will show you all of the big um, companies, betting companies, and it will show all the odds um, from all of these companies. So if we click on one individual match, it will show us the breakdown of the home draw and away and who's got the best odds. So here, if we're looking for Portsmouth, there's quite a lot of bookies that are giving six to one on Portsmouth. So Skybet, William Hill, Betfair, Sportsbook, Unibet, and there's all of those. And that's great for us, especially with accumulators. So all we need to do is we need to click on Portsmouth here, which we've already done, um, to add to our bet slip on the right. And then we just go for accumulators. It's perfect because all we need to do is keep clicking the teams we like, and then it will show us who at this point in time has the best odds um, for our accumulator, which is so much easier than having to look individually at each um, individual game. So once we've picked our selections, all we need to do is click on, say, Portsmouth here to beat Arsenal. Then we're going to go for Nottingham Forest to beat Middlesbrough. And then we'll look further down, see if we can find any other games. And say we believe Chelsea and Liverpool is going to be a draw. On the top right, we have it will show us in our bet slip who has the best odds for that accumulator. And it's with this example, it's 74.9 to 1. And it's Feebet are the company that are giving the best odds. Now, what we can see is why it's so much value you get from this is if you see some of these companies at the bottom may only be giving out 60 to 1. So if we're putting on 10 pounds, we'd be winning 600 with Bet365, but we'd be winning 700 and nearly 750 pounds, another 150 pounds for the exact same bet. And that is where we get such good value from Odds Checker. It can, it can save us. I mean, it's a free site anyway, but it can really make you some extra money if you fancied that anyway. And if you wanted to set up an account with someone else, you should do it because if you're going to have 10 pound on, that's another 149 pounds you're going to make. So it's really easy for me to say, you know, all you need to do is go and find value from these football teams and then put them all into an accumulator and you've boosted value. But how do we find value? And that is that can be very tough, especially when there's not a lot of sport on. So what I do is there's a betting site called Betting Kingdom and they're brilliant because they have tipsters on at all times um, tipping up events for football, horse racing, volleyball. And if you if you were short of ideas of what to bet on, you could go on this site. It's a free site. You can click on something. Um, we'll click on this uh, half past three. There's a football match. Um, FK Vitosha or draw versus ETAR. And you'll get a little 
caption of why they think that this is a good bet and the odds here and the bookies with the best odds. So if you didn't have a clue and instead of going for a rant, completely random um, football accumulator, you could go on here or accumulate on sports, on football, uh, on horse racing or boxing. You could go on here, have a little look because there's normally a lot of tips on here at every given time. And then you could go, actually, I I'd like to have five pounds on this top one here, Vitosha, and then I could do this horse here, 20 to 1, and this bet here on the football with uh, Pizzi, Pizzi to score two or more goals. And there you go, already you could have your accumulator set up from guys that, like I say, you can click on the, click on the tips and then see what they say and uh, done. And these guys don't make any money from it because it all they're playing for is They've got a tipster competition, and if they top their tipster competition, then they get money for that. They can maybe make £200 um, in a month for being the top tipster. And that's why it's win-win for us, because it's free to use. And these guys, you don't have to use any of their tips. If you like what they say, you can use them, which is perfect. So as we know, accumulators are hard to win. But if we want to add extra value and extra edge to our accumulators, there is a thing called with Betfair Acre Edge, which is as you can see here on the right hand side. With the, if you want to add, you can apply Acre Edge, and if you do that, it will give you less odds for your money. But if one loses, then you get your money back as cash. I think that's a great little example um, for anyone that wants to do, if they really feel they've got three really strong teams and they've got one that they're not so sure at, maybe play, applying Acker Edge with Betfair, you can press that. It will then reduce your treble to only 6.22. But for your pound, if you placed it, if they all won, you'd still get six, you'd get six pounds per two. If one lost, then you would still get your, your stake back as a, as a uh, cash result. It's also worth noting there are other insurances um, with a lot of betting companies whereby they give you money if just with their accumulator. If you bet more than, say, eight selections or six selections, then if you get six out of seven, they might just give your money back as a free bet, which, again, is great for us if we're using, um, if we're going to place these accumulators anyway. We want to use those bookmakers that will give us our money back if we get six out of seven. Frustrating as it is, at least it gives us another chance to have another go um, on another another accumulator, which is great. There are a lot around, and also Bet365, I know they've been doing, previously they've done um, enhancements. So if you do more than, say, seven selections, they might give you a 10% bonus if they all come in. If you do 10 selections, they might give you a 20% bonus, and all the way up to maybe a 100% bonus. If you do enough teams, you get a 100% bonus, which is great and well worth looking into just to give us more of an edge when we're trying to make money from these bets. Um, betting accumulators so i hope that video has been of use guys and if it has been please like subscribe and hit that bell notification that would really help because i want to just help you guys you know any little edge we can find and make a bit more money out of these bookmakers would be fantastic um, i hope you're good hope you're having a good week and if you're doing some accumulators gamble responsibly but also add in all of these little tips i've given you today and uh, we'll hopefully make a little bit more money thanks guys take care